So here's the second word we need to define and then differentiate later on. Exegesis is the determination of the meaning of the biblical text in its historical and literary context. And so, exegesis now is the determination of the meaning of the biblical text. So, kung yung hermeneutics set up principles, when you apply these principles to the Bible, it's now called exegesis na. Alright. So, if hermeneutics consists of the principles by which the meaning is determined, exegesis is the actual interpretation of the text. Okay, no blanks there in your notes. It's all there. Now, the third word we need to define and differentiate is exposition. So, your exposition now is the communication of the meaning of the text with its relevance to present-day hearers. So, ano nga yung difference nito? Hermeneutics, set of principles. When you apply these principles to the Bible, you're now doing exegesis. Once you dig up the meaning from the Bible and then you begin to share it on Sunday morning, you're now doing exposition. Okay. So, there are two types of exposition. One is homiletics. This is the science and art by which the meaning and relevance of the biblical text are communicated in a preaching situation. So, yung uh, exposition, pwede preaching, but then also it can be in a teaching situation or pedagogy. Pedagogy, again, the context here is teaching situation. So, behind the pulpit, bukas ng mga, ano, on Sunday morning, that's a... Uh, Homiletics. Sa Sunday school room, that's pedagogy. Okay. 